To continue, next I'd like to explain about the CVT. And the CVT is down in here. We developed a new CVT for this Civic that can handle the high output and high torque of the new engine. We did new designs so that we could make the CVT match well uh, with the large torque fluctuation of the turbo engine. We developed an exclusive uh, torque converter. I'm sorry. We developed an exclusive torque converter. Torque converter. Yes. We developed. Sorry. Uh, we developed an exclusive torque converter for this engine. And versus the conventional engine, it is a 4.7% higher ratio. There's a reason why Honda chose to pair a torque converter to the turbo engine. Out there in the world, a lot of the turbo vehicles now have uh, DCT transmissions. However, in those systems, often you have a lot of hesitation at launch. Honda wanted to further improve the marketability uh, of the transmission, so we added the torque converter to help have a smooth launch and also strong driving performance, strong acceleration performance. We also, to make the overall weight of the powertrain of both the engine and the transmission together uh, lighter, uh, we worked on various things. Lighter than the previous one. As a vehicle, it's lighter. Right. The total powertrain weight. Power train, well, right. no. Power train. It's a little heavier with the turbo. Okay. Uh, hold on, let me clarify and make sure. Shario toshite karuku natte mas. Power train toshite engine mo mission mo ryoho fukumeta ra skoshi omoku na. So overall, the weight of the vehicle compared to the outgoing mm. motor is light. Okay. For the turbo engine combination, with the added turbo, it is slightly heavier than the previous. But the two liter is the two liter powertrain is lighter ah, than the outgoing cool. model. Okay. You've also with the turbo have the intercooler system as well. Right. But we have power that makes up for the slight increase in weight. Okay. Now, I forgot to ask when we were looking at the cutaway. But, um, as far as durability and longevity, the turbo, mm. what, mm. what sort of measures were engineered to you know, live up to Honda's mm. reputation for reliability and quality? Mm. 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 We made various efforts here to maintain Honda's reputation for durability. First, we made sure that the engine room gets a lot of air to cool things off. We also work to improve the durability of the turbo system by using premium materials. The turbine housing is austenite material. The impeller is Inconel steel. Uh, that's a very premium material. But 
it balances both performance and durability very well and we use that to optimize our design of the turbo system. Is it tuned to run on uh, regular unleaded fuel? And on futsu no gasoline desu ka? This runs on regular 87 ron gasoline. Now if somebody wanted to put premium is there any performance premium gas yori haioku ni shitara nene ka seino teki ni tsuyoku narimasu ka? It's still the same, it would still be the same performance, it's controlled by the ECU, the okay. engine ECU. So, so no advantage to running premium? premium. There's not such a big benefit to adding the, the, okay. uh, the high octane gas. 020 engine oil? Engine oil is 0 no 20 Yes. Yeah. Uh, we also adopted low friction oil. Um, and that can handle the high loads as well. And it's conventional, it doesn't need to be, uh, you don't recommend synthetic necessarily? Mm. I'm sorry, futsu no oil desu ka? So desu yo. Gosei oil janakute is regular oil that you can get at a Honda dealership, standard just regular standard, standard oil. Yeah. oil. Uh, what is the or, st uh, typical oil change interval under normal driving? So, the kankaku wa futsu ni hashite tara oil kokan kankaku wa same as normal NA, okay. naturally aspirated engine. Now, do you employ any uh, additional cooling to the oil system? And oil system de sara ni nani ka reikyaku shite masu ka? We cool the oil pan with the airflow into the engine room. As you can see here, we've got a big open area in the grill okay. to get the air so up into the engine room. Uh, there, there is not an oil cooler okay. uh, applied, no. Okay. All right. Um, okay. Is there anything else that you wanted to mention about this engine? Mm. The important thing, I think, for Honda engines is to really have good power and torque. We also worked to improve fuel economy so you can go even further. I think the biggest characteristic of this new turbo engine is all the work that we did in light weighting the engine. Thank you. Thank you very much. The power of dreams.